the height of the foundation wall. We need now to build the wall. How do we uh, take off the wall? We find the area of the wall. The area is measured by taking the depth times the thickness, the depth and the length. All right, the length is the center line of the wall. We had already found the center line, which is that 1.6. What depth is the wall? The foundation wall and above the ground. We shall take 1850 plus 200 is the total wall. We deduct concrete, which is 100. I know that is clear. So 1950 millimeters. So the center line times the depth of the wall. We find the area of the wall, 200 millimeters thick stone walling. In cement sand, ratio 1 is to 3 uh, motor joints. Okay, so now we shall go to height of foundation walling. Uh huh. For height of foundation walling, we shall calculate up to the reduced level so that we can know the volume of the wall that has replaced the volume of the soil because we need to refill and ram this soil up to the reduced level. Okay, so uh, if it's up to the reduced level, we shall take the height of the wall up to the reduced level. Then we shall take it, the volume of that wall so that we can say that volume of the wall has replaced the volume of the soil. So we shall take the soil that was in refill and ram, we shall deduct it equal to the volume of the wall and add it to cut away. We do not need that soil anymore because the soil where it was has been replaced by the wall. Okay, so uh, we shall take foundation wall plus above the ground. Above the ground is 150. Uh -huh. The foundation wall is 1850. Then we shall add foundation wall is 1850. Uh -huh. Then we shall add 200 to get the total height of the wall up to the top of the uh, oversight concrete. So the total height of the wall and the concrete shall be 1850 plus 200, that is 2050. Then uh, we shall deduct the concrete, the oversight concrete, the blinding, 75, then the hard code return. So the total depth that has remained is 485. So this 485 is the one uh -huh, that we need to deduct from this total depth from of the wall 2050 minus 4, 4 minus 485 we get 1565 so this is the depth of the wall below the reduced level that we replace the soil so center line times the thickness of the wall times the depth below the reduced level of the wall which will replace the soil we take that volume of soil remember this one is representing the volume of soil that will be replaced by the wall so we shall deduct from refill and ram and add to cut away 